This is the easiest cow farm for Minecraft Bedrock 1.19. The first thing you're gonna do is dig a two by three hole in the ground. You're then gonna grab a double chest and place it in the center of that hole with two hoppers running into the back of that chest. We're then gonna grab our blocks and place down two blocks on both sides of the chest. We're then gonna build up three for a total of four blocks and then connect them up at the top like so. Grab some glass now and we're gonna fill in this front side with glass. It doesn't need to be glass, however, it does look a lot better and the bottom two need to be glass anyways so that you can still open up the chest. Coming around back now, we're gonna create a little bit of a U shape here, just encasing these hoppers. We're then gonna grab a dispenser and place that dispenser looking in this direction so that it is pointed into the area with the hoppers. We're gonna come around back now and place down a lever on the front of the farm. And that's how we are going to set off the lava for this farm. And then we're gonna place down two signs in the farm like so. That way the lava doesn't kill the baby cows. We're gonna build up another layer just like this. And then we're going to build out by two blocks to create a four by two platform like this. Grab some blocks and we're going to create a row right here just to encase this area. And we're gonna do one more layer and then we are going to place down two blocks right here. That way only baby cows are going to fall into this chamber. We're gonna grab some signs now and place down a sign right here and a sign right here. Then you're gonna grab your water buckets, place down two water buckets at the back of the farm so that the water is flowing into the hopper chamber. And then you need to get two cows into the farm. And after you have two cows, we're gonna place down a temporary block right here and then cover the opening of the farm with fence posts. That way the baby cows don't get launched out of the farm. We're then gonna come down here and we're gonna break these two pieces of glass, replace these signs with blocks, and then replace this glass. Come up here and now we're ready to breed these cows. So all you're gonna do is use your wheat, breed them up, get the baby cow, and then we're gonna breed cows up here until we have about 50 or so cows. Any more than that and you're gonna run into some lag problems, but 50 seems to be the sweet spot for effectiveness and lag. And it should look something like this when you're done breeding them. We're gonna come down here now, break these two pieces of glass. We're then gonna grab our signs and we're gonna replace these blocks with our signs and the baby cows are gonna fall out. Some of them might get shot out, but that's okay. That's like one or two. Replace the glass. And then right here we have two baby cows. And if we come up here, every time we want to keep the farm going, all we're gonna do is come and breed the cows up here. And then all the baby cows are gonna get carried down into the hopper chamber down below where they will eventually grow up. We'll then use the dispenser to have the lava get dispensed, which will then kill the adult cows. And the great thing about this farm is you can breed those cows up top about every two minutes or so. So you could really get this thing going and just have a constant flow of cows. It's been about 20 minutes or so and as you can see we have both adults and babies in this area here so what we're gonna do is we're gonna flick this lever up and down we're gonna wait for the lava get to the other block and then quickly flick it off and this will kill both sets of the cows because the hoppers are on different blocks and it takes a little longer for the lava to get over here they're gonna die at different times but all of the drops are gonna end up in here all the same so as you can see we've got eight pieces of leather quite a bit of cooked beef and this farm is awesome as a food farm and also for getting leather for things like books and bookshelves. All right, that's gonna do it for today. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this one. If you did, please be sure to subscribe and leave a like. Really would mean the world to me. My name is 1UpMC and I will catch you guys in the next one.